Right, if you're an H&R Block customer and you're still waiting for your stimulus check, you're not the only one. The company tells Fox 13 that checks sent to millions of customers were deposited in unfamiliar accounts. Hmm. Fox 13's Jordan Bowen explains how they're trying to sort it out. From confusion to frustration to panic. We're, of course, you know, freaking out a little bit. Okay, wondering who's got our money. It's the case for millions of people who filed their 2019 taxes with H&R Block. Multiple customers tell Fox 13 when they check the IRS website, they learn their $600 payment was deposited, but not in their bank account. It said that it should be deposited yesterday. And um, when I looked at the account number that it was being sent to, it didn't match up with any of my account numbers. I checked my wife. It didn't even match up with hers as well. As it turns out, Drew Acosta is one of many whose stimulus checks were deposited in a separate H&R Block account. It's known as a refund transfer account, and it's set up for customers who don't want to pay for tax services up front and instead have the fees deducted from their refund check. In a statement to Fox 13, the company writes, quote, The IRS determines where second stimulus payments were sent, and in some cases money was sent to a different account than the first stimulus payment last spring. They're sending out tens of millions of checks and it doesn't happen overnight. The government just authorized this. It started happening last week. So it'll be days and weeks before all the checks are sent out. But I understand the anxiety that some people have. H&R Block is now working to get the money in the hands of their customers. A company spokesperson writes, quote, we immediately deposited millions of stimulus payments to customers' bank accounts and onto our Emerald prepaid MasterCard yesterday. As for Acosta, he got his money shortly after this interview. Meanwhile, the company is urging any customers who don't recognize the account number to call them. Reporting in Tampa, Jordan Bowen, Fox 13 News.